Hello, this is Keegan with ImageMO, and today I'm going to be showing you the features in the ImageMO uh, iPhone app. So if you go off to the left here and you click that little arrow, uh, you'll be given all the features uh, and all the ways to display your images. So you can choose the various features and different shapes that you want your images to be displayed and just play around with that until you find the one that you like the best. So I'm going to keep choosing some of this. So if you go over here, we have things like a 3D wall, and like a spinning circle, and some other various shapes that all add a nice effect to viewing your photos and showing your friends and family all your photos. Now if you want to see a photo, just tap it once and then tap it again to make it go full screen if you want to get detail out of a photo. Also if you go up to the top right corner of the little arrow, if you hit it, it turns green. That turns on the automatic slideshow, which will bring a photo up every few seconds automatically which is a really nice feature so you don't have to keep touching the device another f interesting thing would be if you go to the right you hit that arrow it'll bring up all your photo albums so you can choose the different groups of photos that you may have so here I have three photo albums and once again you can just click it and it will come up uh, and then you can view your photos use the same principles that I explained earlier a really nice feature so you get to choose the photos instead of just having your whole library of photos there. Now this is currently the full uh, final product that I'm showing you in the player. So in the player uh, you can this is the final product what it will look like if you enter uh, information when you exported your wrapper so you can have your URL, an email address, and a description with HTML links. So this is like what the, what the final copy would look like and what your recipients would get uh, which is really interesting. Another thing that you can do is if you go up to the top left, that star there will allow you to look at your saved wrappers because this is in the player. So you can see all the saved wrappers that you have made in the actual app. I hope everyone found this tutorial video useful. Please feel free to check out our other tutorial videos on our YouTube channel to learn more.